a sea of gamers. Part of the more than 60,000 people attending E3 this week. Are you ready to rage? And it's all about the games. <laughs> Nintendo showcasing new titles for the Switch, the fastest selling home video game system in the U.S. It's Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. And that's what all of these players are so excited to get their hands on. There's also buzz around Nintendo's new Super Mario Party and Pokemon games. Now players can use the Switch to battle it out in Fortnite, adding yet another platform to play the world's most popular game. Fortnite is the bell of the ball at E3 this year, boasting more than 40 million players in less than eight months. Sony is continuing its legacy of blockbuster games for the PlayStation console, showcasing the highly anticipated Spider-Man ahead of September release. I'm trying to make you feel like Spider-Man more than you've ever done before. Microsoft announced more than 50 Xbox games with 18 exclusives and a focus on more original content. Hoping to get a bigger piece of the pie in what is now a $116 billion industry. This isn't just a little tech bubble of gaming. We are a force to be reckoned with, uh, the same level as movies and music. A force that will be centered in Los Angeles through Thursday building hype around a growing source of entertainment and the booming industry that supports it. Liz McLaughlin, NBC News.